Christ above. You see the paper today? Everything's absolutely fucked. An earthquake in India, another flood in Taiwan, they say Wall Street's on the brink of collapse. And to top it all off, famine again in Africa. Ah, sure, they're always having famine over there, aren't they? Well, it's happened before, yeah. You think yeah. at this stage they'd have learned to plant crops right at this stage? I mean, how hard can it be to toss an old spud in the ground? Oh, I don't think that's the point. You can't tell me there's not enough water to fucking um, Victoria, Victoria Falls over there and all, yes? I think they're missing the point. I'm just saying they're not getting a cent out of me. What? Huh? What? Nothing. I didn't say anything. Nothing. I didn't say anything. You thought it, didn't you? Thought what? That I'm cheap. That I'm on fucking charity. Uh, you just informed me you wouldn't be donating to the famine charity. Yeah. Just now I did, but I've been charitable in the past, haven't I? Yeah, didn't I spend a five or two Christmases ago on that um, band-aid single? Oh, you did an all fair play to you. Wasn't it shite? It was a charity single. Was it? And was it not shite? <laughs> Pretty shite, yeah. yeah. That Gimp Galdoff running around, you know, calling anyone to cancel the debt. I tell you, there's not enough money in the world to pay the debt my ears are owed for listening to that guy. Hear, hear, old sports. Ah, fuck off. You okay, Amo? Yeah, I'm fine, I'm fine, I'm ground. Still though, the conditions over there are shocking. You want shocking here now? What? What do you mean, what? I, uh, I don't know what I'm supposed to. Two nil down the fucking Rovers with 15 minutes to go. <laughs> Simply being slurred. The family victims got away lightly. Oh, I backed this youth team to go all the way this year. I put all my poker winnings on it. All my poker winnings. You talk about them Africans being poor. But you couldn't do it, could you? You couldn't even get one shot on target, you used to be a hero for me. Take a famine over this any day. Well, the grass is always greener on the other side. Uh, come on, if there's a famine, how would they grass? <laughs> Figure of speech, Emma. Just a shanical. No, I don't want to see him. That's what a shanical is. I know what a Sean fuck all is. It's shanical. <laughs> Whatever, it's an old saying, end of story. You're right, Emma. I'll put it on the kettle for a cup of tea. Do you want one? Yeah. And have you any biscuits? No. Ah, oh, jeez, I can't even listen to this shite anymore. Oh, my concubinance. Every cent. Fantasy football, my hole. You had anyone playing in the match earlier? Uh, I had uh, the keeper, Adams, uh, the wingers, Jones and Silvio, and your man Santos up front. How did they do on points? Uh, Adams did all right. The other three just got a point for playing. Uh, and I had Robbins yesterday. He cost me points. Uh, Spanner had to go and get himself sent off oh, two man. minutes ago. That's tough. How are the scores looking? I was ten points clear at the top yesterday. And now? Oh, joined second with Mazza and Podge is eight points in the lead. Jesus, Podge in first place. We'll never hear the end of it. Well, Podge is one thing, but Mazza. Mazza. How in God's name is he managing to come second? He doesn't seem to have a clue about soccer. He hasn't a clue, full stop. Sure, look at his team. I haven't even heard half the fellas he has playing for him. I bet he hasn't changed his lineup since the season started. Hey, he is coming in second, though. Yeah. Yeah, how's he doing it, though? Well, you can ask him now, anyway. He's on his way up. Here? Yeah. I saw him down in the shop, told him to stop in for oh, a bit. Jesus, no, I can't take him today. Not today. He can go burn the or somebody else. I'm not sitting here listening to him talk about the most epic night he's ever had. Oh, it's yeah, we missed out on it. Probably had some funny old joke or something. Lighting the mood and that. Lighting the mood and the collective fucking IQ. Mazza! <laughs> well, Mazza, what's the crack? Mazza! <laughs> You're out on the town last night, you were. Last, last night was no exaggeration. It's the most epic night out ever. I can't believe you missed it. Really, Matthew? Tell me what was so epic about last night. Everything. Everything. Everything, man. Everything was epic. Yeah, it was everything! Did you get a taxi in, did you? Hey, yeah! And that was epic, was it? Yeah! And am I right in saying you went to an epic club? Yeah, man! And was the epic club epic? Yeah, man! And did you get food afterwards? Yeah, man! Oh, I got the most epic, epic curry cheesy chips in the world! Oh, man! That was amazing! You said that at exactly the same time as me! Seriously? Seriously, I'm coming joint second with this lad! <laughs> what? The league, man! You're coming second in the league! He doesn't even know he's coming second in! The Fantasy Football League. You know, the one we do every year. Come on, like! Oh, yeah! <laughs> Second day. Ah, oh, that's alright, isn't it? Mazza! Yeah, it's not too shabby, man. Hey, if I'm coming second, though. Who's coming first? Podge, apparently. Podge? Well, how's he beating me? That lad hasn't a clue. Right, that's it, I'm going out. I'm going to get some fresh air, go to the shop or something like that.
Maybe I'll get hit by a bus if I'm lucky, eh? Any chance he grabs a few miles for us, eh, man? No! Ah, go on. No. Ah, go on, I'm mad for one. Thought you'd be more of a sneakers man, Mars. No, man. Mars is a job, man, then. Eh, don't say it! Don't fucking say it! Don't describe those bars as that, because they're not. They're just bars. They're just chocolate and toffee. There's absolutely nothing fucking epic about them. <laughs> but at least you're doing some good by getting them. What? Look, if you're going to the no, shop, no, will you just go with you? No, no, I want to hear this. What, 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 what do you mean by that last comment there, Mazza? What good are you doing by purchasing a Mars bar? Hmm? What good exactly? Leave off your name, Mazza. Now let him answer the question. Well, some of the money goes to charity. <laughs> charity? <laughs> Every buy you buy, ten cent goes to help him with the famine in Africa. Christ. Don't get me started, man. The bloody famine in Africa. Well, you asked the question, man. That's it. I've had enough. I'm out of here. Good luck. Has he got something against Mars bars or something? Yeah, that's right. Hates Mars bars, that man. <laughs> Mortally afraid of them. Really? Oh yeah. He got locked into a storeroom full of them when he was six and a half. Had to eat his way through seventeen crates of them to get free. <laughs> No, you spastic. He's just pissed off over the fancy football league. Ah, sure, that's only a game. He's got all his poker winnings from the year riding on this one, Mars. Ah, I said he wants to lighten up a little bit, that lad. It's not like he's got to worry about putting food on the table in the middle of a famine or anything. He'd want to get his priorities in order. Sure. I was already telling him about the famine this morning, and he went off on a tangent about Bob Geldof. <laughs> What's he got to do with Africa? Sure. <laughs> <laughs> Live aid, Mazza. Jesus, that was a great song! One of the greatest! Worst the wise man, I'd keep that opinion to myself if I were you. Oh, don't tell me he hates that tune! More than Mars Bars, Mars. More than Mars Bars. <laughs> well, why did this thing on with the sound then anyway? Sure, what's the point in that? Hamer was watching it earlier but found it tough to watch, I guess. Do you have anyone playing it? Having a clue? Actually, that like coming on now, I've got him on my Mal on Chunda. Who? I don't know. I just heard his name on the radio, I liked the sound of it, I guess, so I picked him. Any chance I know a glass of water, man? I'm getting the taste of the egg in the back. Football, football, football. You lads care way too much about it, you know that. You know, it's just, you know, relax about the whole thing. Chill the beans. Relieve the tension, you know. Cl close your eyes. Lie down. Relax your jaw. Don't form a picture. You cheeky shite. Hey, man, I was telling you the story last night. I was chanting this bird. It's epic. And... Hey, what's that you got in your hand, man? Is this your advice? Uh, well, what is it? I don't know. Oh, just a list of the top most promising players of 2011. And a short bio on each. Ah, oh, it's not mine, man. And right here on the other side, there are a few sums. Seems to be working out. Goals per game average. And predictions for the weekend's matches. Ah, it's definitely not mine, man. And right up here in the corner, someone's drawn what looks to be a big penis. <laughs> entitled Mazacock. Kryptonite only makes it harder. <laughs> and then they've drawn what I presume is meant to be Lex Luthor, only he's a bald, circumcised cock. They've even got Mazakov pubes as the Superman curls. So, ah, fuck. What's this all about? Well, he's a superhero, but he's a cock! Not the picture, Mazza, the soccer facts, the league predictions, and tactical stuff. You really know your stuff, don't you? You're on top of your game when it comes to this league. Class by the balls. Oh, pretty much, man. What are you playing at? You've been hustling Emma and the boys all along. Man, no, man, I'm hustling no one. I just... You know, they were talking a big game about the transfers on that. And I can't stand it. It's boring. We've got all the stats and transfers here. Yeah, I know. I, I do them out to my own time, and then I'm done with them. I just don't like talking about them. That's how I'm... Amo's always burning the air off me. I'm sick. I'm sick and down. Have him tell me about how he's made the greatest transfer ever. And how much it's going to cost us. Unbelievable. So you properly manage your team? Well, I'm hardly just randomly coming in second. <laughs> I'm, I'm only having to crack because Amos gets so wound up about the whole thing. He's an awful grumpy boy. He always has been. He always will be. And all the boys think so too. Hang on. You mean everyone else knows that you're, you know, not as fast <laughs> A few <laughs> puzzles, but anyway, he just finds it hilarious that I wind him up so much about the whole thing. I'm not going to lie to you. So do I. Unbelievable. Ah, oh, man. I have such an epic laugh with the most epic people all the time, but then when the epicness gets too much, there's no more of better than to rah me on name. Mazza! <laughs> How would you feel if someone like that beat you in the league that you care about so much? Hey, you're only coming in second, though. How do you wait till this lad gets a touch of the ball? Mal on Trondaman. 
They only just signed him last Christmas. He's from Zambia. Never kicked a real football till he got to England. Never heard of him. Had his surprising. He was injured in his first training session. This is his first appearance for City. He's only just recovered. He's been playing reserves for the last month. Reserves? What's he doing coming on now then? They need someone who's going to give them a goal or two, not some bloody debutant from the reserves. Oh man, this lad's magic, man. He's hungry for the game. He's going to grab me a hat-trick today and send me top of the You're league. fucking kidding me. Ah, he won't even touch the balls. There's only five minutes left. Five minutes is all this guy needs, man. No <laughs> way. Here's Amar now. Hey man, I'll make a deal. This guy grabs me a hat-trick. You keep quiet about my over-awareness about the goings on in the league. Deal. Mazakov, though. Seriously? <laughs> <laughs> Turn that strike off. Can't stand the damn thing. That walk to be the world of good, Amon. I can feel the sense of zen emanating off you. Any sign of that marriage, perhaps, Amon? Oh, Jesus Christ. You know what? Mazza, if I was locked in a room with you, a lion, and a man eating shark, and I'd have gone with two bullets, I'd cheat you twice. <laughs> Remember that, Amon? A lion and a shark in the same room. You're only being ridiculous now. Amon. John was telling me you've quite a lot of money driving on this game, Amo. Was he now? <laughs> yeah, I was wondering how much you put on it. I don't want to discuss it. Fifty? A hundred? A hundred? Two hundred and twenty euros and seventy-five cents, all right? That's how much I've lived on this fucking game! That's quite a lot of money, Amo. Oh, thanks. <coughs> hey, and you know what he's saying? You'd never put all your eggs in the one basket. Really? Who says that? Who fucking says that, huh? Don't! Fuck off! Aren't you a genius? The way you can analyse the bets that other people make with your fucking shan shan! Shan! Whatever! Doesn't matter what bets have you made recently! What smart fucking bets have you made? Calm down, Amon! No! Who, does he think he, who do you think you are? Are you coming to my house, plug yourself down on my couch, and tell me what's right and wrong with my bets? Why don't you go out and make some bets of your own, huh? Why don't you go out, scrape some money together, and make your own fucking bets? When was the last time you even made a bet, huh? Exactly. I'm about to make one now, actually. Oh, really? Yeah. I'll bet you City win. That's hilarious. You're a spastic. No, 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 man. I'm serious. I'll bet you City win the game. Three, two. And what money have you bet with? Well, I can't pay enough. I've got some money. Too. But I will reimburse you for the bet you made for City. Yeah, and if they win? Well, what else do you get from yours? Three to one. And right, well, if City win, I get the money you originally bet. The 220 euro. And 75 cents, yeah. <sighs> Which and you have twice that between winnings. You can't pay me <coughs> No. And they want to marry Sarah. <sighs> you're bullshitting me. No, man, you're caught. You don't go with it, you probably lose. You take it. At least you walk away with something worst case scenario. Why are you making the bet, Mazza? None of business. Why, Mazza? None of your business. Same value. Five cents. Five. What's in it for you? Five. John? Three. Go for a man. Ten. Go, Go on then. Eh. <laughs> <laughs> tell me. Why are you making the bet, Mazza? I don't know. I just got a good feeling about you. A, a good feeling? <laughs> you don't know anything about soccer. You're done. I'm in second in the league. I must know something. Yeah. What do you know then? Well, I know that Marlon Chonda scored just as you turned the TV off a few moments ago. What? And I'd be willing to bet that he scored again while you spend your time worrying about whether to take the bet or not. <laughs> How did you... Jesus, Mazza. How? I don't know, man. How the fuck did you pick that? I don't know. I just had a great feeling about that lad. What? What lad? Man on Chunder. What? I don't know much about Stel South of Arsenal. I just had his name on the radio and like the sound of it. Better than the sound of Mazza Cop, at any rate. What? Nothing. Two minutes at a time, Jesus. I've got to look this lad up. Just about enough time, I'd say. <laughs> two in, in two minutes is a fluke. All right, there's no way he's going to get a third. You haven't a clue about football. A two's all United can manage, two's all anyone's going to manage. Ah, man. Have a little faith, Amo. I don't need faith. I'm sorted. I yeah. get my money back either way. <laughs> you don't. You're fucked. You're up shit creek. Oh, what a sensible bet you made. I'm fucking delighted. Good for you, Amo. But our bet was based on whether City won or lost today. I promised you nothing if they drew. What? 